Oh my god. Deep in the burning sands of the desert, a distant land. Okay. Looming over the tower, or the town, the monster tower. With, within this gigantic ancient tower, a host of monsters swarms and breeds. Despite the long and hazardous desert journey, the town, uh, yeah, something, treasure hunters. They come seeking the golden horde, oh, oh, but even more, they are lured by the monster eggs. A prize found nowhere else. When a monster is grown from the egg, it can be tamed. Eggs and tame monsters fetch high prices in gold, and rare breeds of monster can make a vast fortune for the hunter. The town has grown rich from buying and selling monsters, so the town is called Moonsbaya. In Moonsbaya lives a certain youth. His father understood the hearts of the monsters and gained renown as the greatest monster tamer of all. Sadly, he died early, leaving their mother to bring up the youth and his sister alone. The small family struggled to survive, to hunt for monster eggs and make my fortune. The youth had inherited skills as monster tamer from his father. He longed with all his heart to hunt for eggs. But entrance to the tower is something forbidden to those not yet 15. The mighty towers a nest of a maze to confuse the unweary. Its dark depths fill even old experienced egg hunters venture but a short way into the vast interior. The law against entering is strictly enforced. Oh. <laughs> okay. Oh, you're awake. You're about to be reborn. All you can decide on is your name. What star you will be born under can only be determined by God. Please hurry up and decide. I want to finish my job and take a nap. Have you decided on a name? Ah. Uh, so, you will be ah. Uh, is that okay? Hmm. Yeah. All right, ah. Uh, your new life is about to begin. Your own life, your own story. Make sure you're positive. Every, make every effort and live life happily and joyfully to the fullest or else on your way, enjoy. You're not gonna remember this. Wah, wah. Wreath, you did well. He's a boy. Haha, <laughs> he looks just like me. Have you thought of a name? Let's see. How does Ko sound? Ko? No. I feel there's a name that better fits him. I've got it! <laughs> How's that? That's good! His name is Ah! It's as if God had already picked that name for him a long time ago. Ah's dad! Guy. <laughs> yeah? What's the matter, Nico? Sob. Ah is teasing me! Listen, uh, a man's gotta, uh, must take good care of women. That's it. I wonder if Guy made it to the top level. What? Oh, yes. Guy's the only one who, that could possibly make it to the top. Guy. Huh? What's the matter? My necklace. It broke. Die! Oh no! Whoa! Whoa! What the heck? It's been decades since it rained like this in the desert city of Moonspire. Wreath is one tough woman. She must be worried sick about those strange occurrences the day before yesterday. 
at that ancient tower Guy went to. Don't be silly, Grandpa. Wreath is a woman after all. Ah, uh, Guy? Gyr. It's Guy's familiar. He's got Guy's monster tamer collar on him. Why is a familiar with Guy's collar uh, here with no sign of Guy? Ah. Uh, Guy! Konami Computer Entertainment says Tokyo presents. Azure Dreams. Is this like an E3 trailer? Ready? Ew. It's like early 90s like anime style and it's weird. I really like how ugly it is. Damn, this RPG Maker game's crazy. Crazy though. It's a shame there was never any other uh, games. Nico, get up! <laughs> That's just one step away from fucking putting a cartoon. <laughs> Today is your 15th birthday. It's the day you've become an adult. That's what constitutes as an adult. Weedy. Yup, can't you be a bit more gentle? Good morning, Nico. The priest is already here. Get up and greet him, hurry. Yep. Thanks, Weedy. Oh, I can't get on the bed now. That's great news. Uh, that means that now you'll be able to enter that tower you've always wanted to go to. Are you heading out for the tower already? Of course. Then take this with you. A pita fruit is received. Wow. Go to your best. Yep. Thanks, sweetie. Don't stumble. Yep. Thanks, sweetie. Okay, so B is to run. Food familiar. Yep. Aren't you a monster tamer? <laughs> Aren't you a monster tamer? Hey, hey, don't be frightened. I'm not your enemy. Very sus. What do you want? Um, are you going in alone? No. Liar. Monster Tamers use monsters to fight, but you don't even have a single familiar on your side. They're very important for fighting. You can't take this by yourself right uh, right now. Uh, you have a magic collar, don't you? I can smell it. Believe it or not, I once used to be a familiar for a great monster tamer. But my master passed away, and now I'm lo a lonely familiar. And people want to have nothing to do with me, since I know the human language. But I can't love, uh, lower myself to become a monster now. They just live by instinct. You can put your collar on me if you w like. <laughs> Alright, you can join me. 
great. From now on, you are my master. Give me a name. Hmm, Slavey. I think my old master gave me the same name. By the way, uh, I'm Mr. Ah. Yes, Master Ah. Uh, you are a beginner, aren't you? I can tell, okay? I will teach you many things about the tower. Let's go. Wait, what about my food? Wait! <laughs> Wait, my pita food! Wait! <laughs> pita bread! No, I don't want to go in with you! Bye-bye. He's dead. Slavey became unable to fight and returned to the bag. I'm dead. Get up! Yep. Good morning. It's almost high noon. Hurry up and get up. Here. Get up. Dude, Weedy is, like, on some shit. Hey, buddy! Slavey! It's a new type monster. Don't worry, buddy. I'm gonna fucking sell you. I'm gonna f Oh, no. Alright. He's taking a bath. Giggles. Eek! Giggles. But this feels good like this. The temple. Do you want me to give you information on the specifics of the tower? I don't need you to tell me. <laughs> Selfie. Hi there, puffy lips. I too started a tower adventure for magic training. I shall become a monster tamer true to my legendary family name, Road. It must be nice that your family still exists. I'm gonna go in your house. Who are you? Ah, how's it going? Not good at all. Wish you well. I have nothing else to say to you. Who are you? Gosh. Finally! They have decided to rebuild that wrecked up house that was ruining the, uh, the scenery of the city. A restaurant. Patty. Hello, can I help you? I'd like something to eat. Really? You want something to eat? Then please sit there. What would you like? I'm poor. Could I have some rice? One order of rice coming up. Just a moment. Shit, I need to get the fuck out of here. Here you are. Yes, it's rice. Let's see. Rice, not even my pet back um, back home will eat that. Patty, I've changed my mind. I'll have to uh, I'll have what I always have. Okay, that the special, right? And Patty, add some of your love to that. R right. Maybe this is my chance to leave while I can. Well, well, well. If it isn't ah. Uh, I never expected you to be eating out. <laughs> you never know. Patty, keep a close eye on him so that he doesn't escape without paying. <sighs> Shut up, you weirdo. Are you calling me a weirdo? Hey, wait! <laughs> I'll be back. I can't take it anymore. <laughs> I don't have money. I don't have money. I'm poor. <laughs> Bar. <laughs> I 
but I wonder if I can do this. I don't even know if I can. All right, I'm I'm, I'm gonna, gonna I'm gonna sing Barbie Girl. Uh, uh, I'm gonna sing Barbie Girl. Here we go. Hi, hi, Ken. Sure, Ken. I'm a Barbie girl, in the Barbie world. Life is plastic. It's fantastic. You can brush my hair, undress me everywhere. Imagination, life is your creation. I'm a Barbie girl. Oh my God, the bass in the Barbie world. Life is plastic. It's fantastic. You can brush my hair and undress me everywhere. Let imagination, life is your creation. <coughs> you can touch. <coughs> that was awful. Holy shit. Okay. Well, I hope that was funny. Yeah, I'd like a. Uh, yo, you started going to that tower. Ha 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 ha. Y'all listen to that. He's calling himself a hunter. You could get yourself killed t uh, taking the tower too lightly. Well, uh, we'll educate you on what we've experienced. Consider yourself lucky. But we're not going to repeat everything we say, so listen carefully. Uh, he, he didn't tell me. He, 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 he keeps repeating himself. Stop it. Let me get away from you. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. Jesus Christ. No, stop. No, stop. He doesn't even tell me anything. What an ass. <laughs> I'm half expecting like a fucking Attack on Titan monster to come right through this wall to kill us all. What is this? Hospital. I mean, I if I, if I was able to, I would have named them property if that makes you feel better. Die! I just fucking stomp on his skull like he's a bug. Yeah. Yeah, like a little insect. Gets what he fucking deserves. Yeah! Cave his skull in. Alright. What the? <laughs> what? <laughs> uh, oh, what? Uh, no! What? There's no freaking way! What? Uh, uh? I don't like the violence. You'd do the exact same thing if it was a tiny little piece of shit bug. You would fucking crush that thing under your foot. Oh no, now it's now it's bigger and it's a normal sized animal. It's all of a sudden bad because it's, it's larger. It's not how it works. If I could crush a squirrel under my foot, I would. <laughs> That's <a> fucking psycho. <laughs> There should be there should be a PETA for uh, a company a PETA company <laughs> for for insects for poor poor little like spiders. It's inhumane for you to kill those poor little spiders. It doesn't matter if they're if they're in your house. Th those poor those poor spiders did nothing wrong. I'm about to die. Uh... <sighs> <laughs> what is this? Bad because it's, it's larger. It's not how it works. <laughs> if I could crush a <laughs> <laughs> If I could crush a squirrel under my foot, I would.
If I could crush a squirrel under my foot, I would. And stay it so far out of context! <laughs> It's taking so much out of context. <laughs> He's sleeping. Don't leave him alone. Oh, god damn it. Ah, Lois. Oh, ah, shit, Lois. Ow. Leave me alone. Wait, where's my friend? Holy fuck, Lois. Holy fuck. I got a gold sword. Oh no, it was cursed! No! The gold sword was cursed and cannot be taken off. Oh no. Huh? It's just ah. You feel lonely and want my help, don't you? Do you wish to stay close to me? Oh no. I feel lonelier. Hmm. How rude! Your speech and behavior are not very courteous. I cannot allow it anymore. We shall battle right now, right here. I accept your challenge. Fight. Wait! Oh no, wait! I'll give you this herb. I guess... I let my guard down a little. So, one win, zero loses for you. I'll be back. Bro gave her the za, that's a dude. I'm kind of sad uh, that this game doesn't have like a sequel or anything. This is really cool. This is just another one of those like dungeon games. You know, like the uh, du mystery dungeons like I said earlier. It's really neat. Uh, although I will say that the... I kinda wish that the sequel would be on PC. You know, like, not on this piece of shit. Uh, console, PlayStation. Are you the general store? I don't even know what this is. Fortune House. Welcome to Fortune Telling Palace. Known as the mother of, yep. Would you like to know your fortune? Sure. Hmm, I can see that your personality has great depth. Aw, thank you. What would you like me to look into today? On how to enjoy life. Ha! Huh. There's no limit to the number of ways on how. Alright, relax and give me answers. Uh, and give me answers to my questions. Between work and love, what's, uh, what's important? Wait, what's important is love, right? Uh. Uh. Yes? Do you believe you cannot live through life alone? No? Do you feel that you, you'd like to conquer life itself? Yes? If your friend was hurt, would you not be able to sit still? Yes? Would you be able to give up uh, your feelings for a girl to a, uh, to a love rival if that love rival was your friend? Oh, this is fucking... Deep, holy, what? Uh... Love rival. First of all, the term love rival is kind of stupid. Ma'am. Uh... Uh... It's complicated. Um... No? Do you feel that there's nothing better than to earn easy money? Yes? Do you enjoy game? 
you do enjoy games. Don't you? Yes. Do you feel that gambling is not a good thing? Yes. Huh. I can see it. This is, exci this is the exciting lifestyle I recommend to you. Simply put, a lifestyle full of entertainment suits you. I can see that you are one fellow that never gets bored of play. Why not spend your life playing all you like? You could build facilities like an entertainment center or a bowling center. And why not a pool? Just imagine the girl of your dreams in a swimsuit. Just imagine the girl of your uh, of your dreams in a swimsuit. Fuck. Of course, that's not everything there is to life. Seek the lifestyle that suits you best. Is there anything else you'd like to know? Uh, yes, there is. What would you like me to look into? On my love life. Ha! Huh. You're still young. Naturally, this is what you want to know. Alright, relax and answer my questions. Would you like to play outside if the weather is good? No. Would you like the woman to be a family oriented person? No. Are you a good listener? Yes. Are you the type that can focus on one thing and one thing only? No. Funny to say so yourself, but do you consider yourself spoiled? No. Do you feel that there are times you must have the courage to step away from the one you love? Yes. Ha, huh, I can see the perfect woman for you. Her aura is much weaker than what you would normally expect from a girl. Furthermore, your aura, aura is heading in a different direction than hers. In other words, if things remain as is, you two may never see each other even though you live in the same city. But that's too sad for me to take. Sniff, sob. For her sake as well, I would like uh, to bring the two of you together. Listen closely now. Your lucky zone is the hospital. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> Your lucky zone is the hospital. What, you want me to fucking just stand, like, get hurt on purpose? <laughs> I'm gonna fucking harass people at the hospital? What the fuck? Also, when walking the streets, always tell yourself repeatedly that you truly want to meet this girl. Unfortunately, I can't tell you anymore. Good luck. <laughs> this fucking old hag told me to fucking, like, stalk people at a hospital. What the fuck? Is there anything else you would like to know? Uh, yeah. What would you like to look into? <laughs> On how to fight. Huh, you're a very clear-minded person. It has to do with your work, doesn't it? Alright, relax and answer my questions, please. Do you like animals? Yes. <laughs> Ignore the comment from earlier. Do you believe uh, you take care of others? Uh, you take good care of others? Yes. Do you feel that allies, uh, that allies are wonderful to have? Yes. Are you interested in mystical things? Yes. Uh, have you felt an urge to use magic? magic? Yes. Do you often find yourself acting as a meditator in a fight? Uh, no. Do you consider mathematics a nightmare? Yes. Ah, I see it. One thing, the one thing you lack the most when you fight. That one thing is fusion. It shows uh, here that the one thing is fusion. You have no idea how to effectively fuse your monsters together. I will tell you what you need to to know for an effective fusion. First, 
the post fusion monster will be the, uh, of the stronger category. For example, if a fire monster and water monster were to fuse, since the water dominates the fire, uwu, uh, the fused monster will be a water monster. The appearance will also be that of a higher level monster. If the category of the magic is different, the level will not increase. Finally, uh, you would think that it would be useless fusing two monsters unless they knew uh, magic, but this is not necessarily the case. Fusing two monsters that have no knowledge of magic may produce a completely new type uh, magic or significantly increase the basic status. For example, a, pul a palumpa uh, that is much quicker than normal. Fusing this type of monster with a monster that has magical powers will give you an even stronger familiar. Break away from your friends uh, by making the best familiar you can. I pray for your health. Is there anything else I would like you'd like to know? No, I'm leaving. Thank you for it very much. Come back again whenever you have something on your mind. Uh okay. Um You only have like three options to choose from. That was something. Only one of those actually mentioned anything related to the game uh yeah i want you to hang around a hospital <laughs> that's the perfect place for you to catch a girl <laughs> i wonder what would happen if chris chan played this game wait is this the general store please tell me this is the yes finally oh it's you uh pleasant surprise what brings you here? I'm just looking. Then go home. This wasted discussion uh, is costing me. 1G every minute. You fucking charged me? I hear you've started going to the tower. What's the tower like? It's going okay. That's good. You got a wild look, so bet the wild monsters don't realize you're human. <laughs> you kidding with my face? <laughs> you kidding with my face? Of course. This is where you buy swords. The blacksmith. Woko. Oh, it's you. Don't get in the way of my business. You're only here to bug me anyways. You are absolutely right. <laughs> You're absolutely right. 